Hey loves and welcome back to yet another TikTok train segment with me, your Gazi Taki. Before you talk to face, you can Pansi with our influencers that, especially those that are dating your Nigerian, Ghanaian, and men, they have been crying on the socials and currently trending is and none other than our Miss K Yarns. Before to recently, we did see that Ubis XO was also just one of the girlies that were literally going through the most because of indoor dashi, even went as far as making a video about it crying stating that she is going through a spiritual awakening and she feels like a uh, god is removing the people that are not supposed to be in her life and she just wants companionship now the pandemic is on up because even okay yams uh, was recently crying over her recent uh, breakup from Indota. Yeah, okay, Uflak, we all know Uflak, we, I'm sure we all remember how the Flako Bafuetu has been doing quite a number of things to Miss K. Yams, cheating, doing all these things and that and this. And I'm a fan, K. Yams are quite happy about this one because they low key feel as though this means that perhaps she might get somebody that will appreciate and respect. Okay, Yams, we all know how much most of us respect Okay, Yams because of Umsebenzi Wake Omusle and Umsebenzi Onomekayo for her to be dis disrespected by Uskru Screw as Namaz no Guti Wenzani and Bilene. So People are saying, you are starting to become somebody that you're not. Remember the time uh, that you were addressing his cheating rumors and um, because you wanted the attention to move away from what he's doing to you, the cheating scandals and all of that, you decided to redirect it back to Una Lady. You decided to address something which happened to between you and Una Lady four years ago. So it literally means that this guy was just not good for you because you were becoming a something obungeyona and jay you were just trying so hard to become this screw screw person <laughs> you know and so a lot of people are happy about this one you guys so up next we also have utando and osima they are also trending utando decided to go to yay and it's handy mina oksala isn't when she decided to put her to scent on <laughs> uh, the recent um ghostly b vlog where he gifted usima one million this is what she said about it <laughs> <laughs> now of course you guys i think most of us knew that you know what ghostly did it was all a prank that wasn't real money i even covered up on my other video that it's money um he bought for 189 rands <laughs> on a uh, take a lot you guys but unfortunately because it was utando as uh, saying it a lot of people were just like come on when i get happy first of all how do you know do you even know um the almighty ghost libby's bank have you ever checked it how do you know like oh yeah papa and we so wish that one day usima deals with you the same way that usesi sayen dealt with upapalo so we honestly hope that one day you'll be crying i'm sorry sissy sima as uh, soon because oh yeah papa say now on the other hand we have usima sima was actually celebrating about a week ago and i was like okay uh she's fun to celebrate but we need to know what she did with that one million rands okay and uh i think it was about a day ago when she revealed that actually before to that wasn't even a million rand let's just be honest with one another and i thought that she because she and the almighty goes to be a cool she will not be revealing such things to us but she did take it to her tiktok account to reveal that it wasn't uh actually one million rands you guys so those are the news of the hour what are your thoughts let's just engage one another down on the comments and i will surely see you guys on the next one bye